Well, hello to you and welcome to another exciting game brought to you by EA TV. Guy Mowbray here and Sue Smith is here to commentate with me. And it's a game from the Premier League on the way. It's Burnley versus Arsenal. Thanks, Guy. Well, I can't wait for this one. Both sets of fans are certainly up for it. I'm sure that that'll give the players a real boost. They'll be hoping to start the game at a fast tempo. He's so important to his team's chances is Martin Odegaard. What are the chances of him shining in this game? Well, I love the way he plays. He makes the game look easy. His first touch, his dribbling ability, the way he sees a pass, and then he executes it. He's got to be one of the best in his position. Here's how Burnley line up. Yeah, it looks like they've lined up in a 4-4-2, and they do look balanced in this system. You can defend deep, stay compact, bring the opposition forward, then hit them quickly on the counter-attack. This is how Arsenal line up. Ben White plays with Alexander Zinchenko as fullbacks. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in the centre of midfield. And the main man leading the attack is Gabriel Jesus. And with that, the first half is underway. That's good physical play. Jesus waited beautifully Saka and denied by a top draw tackle that has gone out it'll be a throw Berger, body in the way, good work. Josh Brownhill, Berger. Passing and the movement is good here. But unable to find the killer pass in the end. Saka. On to Odegaard. Havertz. Jesus. Saka. Looking to put the cross in. This could be threatening. Bayer. It's nice possession. Is there a goal to take the lead coming? Well, nothing to get excited about at the end of it. I have it. Jesus. And that's a foul and a free kick. Well, it takes a brave player to have a go from that distance. It's ended up nowhere near. Yeah, that was way off target, Guy. I'm not sure why he's even attempted it. Wasted a decent opportunity. space and he's finding it a chance to deliver into the box and it's not the best of clearances Jesus 
Counter-attack coming, away they go. White, picked out nicely. Havertz, and a marvellous save. Well, he just shows great reflexes and agility to keep that out. It's a top-class save. And the ball comes in, and the defence ready for what was coming. And that'll do it, the end of the first 45 minutes here. Well, there's not been a great deal to admire from Martin Odegaard in the first half. He struggled to get involved in the game. He's not really been himself in the first half. He's hardly... And we're moving once again for the second 45 minutes. Let's hope it's a little bit more open than the first half was. Havertz. Using his body well to keep the ball. Odegaard. They have to clear this. And there's the whistle as the ref gives a free kick. A really good interception to take the ball. Jesus. Martinelli. Need to get tighter here. been viewed as a foul, a free kick's awarded. Well, that's how to clear it. And the whistle goes. Free kick awarded. <laughs> Promising looking ball. This is looking good, now what comes next? And they want to see a shot here. Sinchenko. Kai Havertz. Odegaard. On to Jesus. Martinelli! Being pressed here. Good work from Arsenal to win back possession. That's a nice cutback. It's a breakthrough at long, long last. Well, here it is again, and he's done so well. He's got to the byline, been able to pick out a teammate, and the movement is good to get on the end of it. And it's a simple finish in the end.
underway again. Is there to be one more twist to the tail? Jesus. Oh, a great chance. No problem at all in keeping that one out. Given away by Arsenal. Well, as soon as they won the ball back, there was an almighty roar. The fans are trying to push the team forward and get an equaliser. Jesus. And still the chance might come. And it's held with a real sense of relief. Yeah, he gathers it well at the second attempt, but what a save initially. It's a superb stop. Well, that brings the match to a close. A frustrating day for the fans in attendance, and it's three points dropped. Yes, yeah, certainly not the best performance, was it? Just a little off the pace for me. Obviously a disappointing result, but the key thing is that they bounce back now as they can't afford a repeat next time out. There have been a few good performances out there today, but of all the players on show, he's one that's really caught the eye. Yeah, he played well. Real vital goal too. They just struggled to cope with his quality today.